my mother told me this. When Malcolm was alive, why did he do shit like that? Right, right. And then when he died, that same nigga will be talking about, he interviewed me, he'll be writing a book about right, my life, right, right, and right, it'll right. be the whole thing. Right. And I just don't like that. Right. Support me. If you don't understand right. me, don't write about me. I don't ask black niggas to jock me. I'm just saying, be honest. You know, I'm, you doing something I can't do, and I'm doing something you can't do. I respect you, respect me. You know there's no nigga out here like this. I don't have no insecurity about that, and no no delusions. Ain't no nigga like you if I put it down. My weaknesses and my strengths. But everybody know my strengths definitely outweigh my weaknesses. As long as that, I'm a human being, like everybody else. And, I, and if I meet somebody perfect, then they can train me. And they can help me be perfect, but ain't nobody out there perfect. So we'll all just get along with each other. That's how I feel. You know what I mean? I felt like that was wrong for him to do that because that's something I like I always was raised like there's certain times when you don't fuck with a nigga. When he's down, you don't kick a nigga. That's what I thought. You know what I mean? And all this 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 really taught me about like this black people thing. I don't believe, I, I'm black, I believe in my people, but I believe in my people as it relates to my tribe. I don't believe in us overall just imaginary niggas. Black people attack me. I mean, not all black people. That's why it's not a, it's not a general state. Like, I don't like black people no more. Not that. I love black people. I love my people. I am black. But I'm saying, I don't look at it as general. Right. Now, it's, I'm not racist anymore. I kill myself for racism. Right, right. You know what I mean? Somebody be mad. Like, I'm with somewhere. Somebody seen with a white girl. Bah! I can't believe it, but it's not, to me, it's like, I'm a totally new human being. Before I was like that, and I was bitter, and I, and that's why I was so evil towards black sisters when I went to jail. Because I felt like I didn't sleep, I didn't fuck with them bitches to be there for y'all. And y'all put me in jail? Alright, well cool, but that, I was wrong to have that kind of stuff. Because right. all black women don't owe me shit. Right. And I don't owe them shit, you know what I mean? But to represent, you know what I mean? But to be me, you know what I mean? Procreate, have better seeds, make a better man. I never trust get my point across. And I feel like, yo, I feel like we need our confidence, self-esteem. And that's what I got, man. My confidence and my self-esteem. People might be like, you think you see me, whatever. But I, fuck it. I feel like I shine. And I don't give a fuck how much white people, the media, niggas, black people, play haters, police, whoever, try to darken my shine, I'm gonna always shine through. They can lie about my words, they always gonna reign true. You know what I mean? Because it's my essence. It's in my essence. And that's what's gonna always come through. No, I feel like that's true about me. Like now people feel like he's blasphemy. He's saying black Jesus as blasphemy. Or he's acting like he's elitist. He's like the Muslim, but he's like a five percenter. It's nothing like that. It's only to get out. I feel like the, the our future is our confidence and self-esteem. All this rape and gang banging and killing and 30 niggas fucking one girl, they all come from a low self-esteem and no confidence. As soon as we get out of because I don't think like that. I don't think, let me fuck 30 bitches. I don't even think like I want to be in a room when other niggas is fucking a bitch, man. I don't think like that no more. And not because of jail, but because of my confidence is there, my self-esteem, my self-respect. You know, I don't need that. But in the ghetto, that's the type of shit that we're taught. It's like in the army, you taught to kill, so you kill. You know what I mean? We taught that, my older niggas. We taught that, that the only thing we good for is our sexuality. Now I use that to make money, but I enforce my strength, my mind strength. That's what's more important to me now. The niggas see that there's not no accident. I plotted every single step from this to this. Right. You know what I mean? Everything's plotted. It's hell that you that the next shit is called Illuminati, because that's that's really what the Illuminati's on. That's why I put the K to it. Right. Know what? The niggas is telling me about this Illuminati shit while I'm in jail, right? Like, Right, 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 right. That's another way to keep yourself it, the same up. That's that another shit. way to keep you unconfident. Right. And I'm putting the K because I'm killing that Illuminati shit. Uh, Trust me, if these motherfuckers wanted to kill you, why the fuck they gonna tell Farrakhan? Why they gonna tell the nation of Islam? Why they gonna tell this nigga in jail about the plan? How did he know? How did it leak to him? Who told him? Who told him? The Pope? Who? Because they like the Pope and the money. Uh, come on, man. Get the fuck out of here. So thinking about the money, you're not getting the motherfucking money. Get the money, nigga. I don't give a fuck who face on there. You know what I thought when I was in jail was what fucked me up, what turned me like this is I was like, no politicians is even getting at us. Even though I represent right, right, five million right, fucking right, there. Right, right, right. And no politicians is even checking for us. They're not even sending us nothing, trying to make us. They're not even thinking of it. And in business, you know, if you want to fuck with somebody, right, you right. know, you try to. They're not even looking at us like that. That means we ain't a threat. Right. But right. by the next election, I promise. By the next election, I promise. I'm gonna be sitting across from all the candidates. I'm bitch. You know I'll be making it. I promise. I'm not even gonna be. I'm gonna be so far from where I am now in four years. God willing, I'm alive. It's all. I guarantee you, we will. We will have our own political party.
And it won't be just for black people. It's gonna be for Mexicans. That's my it's gonna be for Mexicans. It's gonna be for black people. It's gonna be for Armenians. I don't give a fuck. All you lost tribe motherfuckers right now, we need to have our own political party because we all have the same motherfucking problem. Build this nation and we get none of the benefits.